Hello everybody, it's Ira with Project Help You Grow. One of the uh, things that I wanted to help people with obviously is growing their network. And I know sometimes people get frustrated with me and other uh, larger network owners on LinkedIn because we cannot accept your friendship requests. It's not that we don't want to, it's simply that we're capped out, right? 30,000 is the max. I'm gonna share my screen with you guys. And what I wanna do is I, I wanna show you on LinkedIn a way that you can still message people because I know everybody's like, you know, yeah, premium is, as you can see here, hopefully on my screen, I am not a premium member anymore. I used to be, I used to spend the money. I just didn't find it was worth it. But the one thing I do miss is being able to end mail. So if you want to connect with people that you're not directly connected to, say you're, you know, following people like for me, example, let me open up another one real quick and I'll show you. Okay, so LinkedIn, and you go to your profile. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch, okay, so you come down here and you go, you know, followers. So one of the things that I do, now I'm almost at 36,000 followers now, right? So um, you can have as many followers as you want. And I suggest, honestly, you follow everybody because there's no risk to it. They don't have any more access to your private information than you know somebody you're not following or that they're not following it doesn't really matter so it does help build their network right like I'm almost at 36 so the cap is 30 um, I have some people that I'm following that I'm not connected to and here's how right I go and I look and see who's following me and I simply follow them as you can see everybody's checked now sometimes they're unchecked and the reason why is um, they have privacy settings that won't allow me to follow them. So even though it says following there, as soon as I reset this thing, it's gonna bounce back. All these people I've clicked on. And uh, anyways, it, it's gonna ruin it. But what's the difference between a connection and a follower? Well, it's access to that private information. It's also access to um, message. Being able to message is the number one thing that you can't do as a second or third level connection that you can do as a first level connection. But a loophole, if you want to call a loophole, I call it an advantage of being in groups with people is if you go into the membership page, like for example, this is a brand new group that I created just a couple weeks ago. It's called Bay Area Referrals Exchange by Ira Bowman. If you're in the Bay Area and you want to grow referrals, if you join this group, even if you don't connect with everybody in the group, you can still message anybody in the group. What you do is you go to the membership page, which I just did. Okay, let me show you that one more time. Every group right up here, like if I go into Project Help You Grow, it doesn't matter, any of these groups, okay, Project Help You Grow right now is 2,568 members. Not even I am connected to all of them anymore because I can't. You know, people want to join. It used to be you had to be a first level connection with me to join. That was part of the conditions of membership. I've taken that away because I can't accept membership uh, requests anymore. So anyways, if you hit this, I think it defaults with your first level connections first, right? So you see how that's first, but you see here you can message. So I doubt, I doubt I'm going to see a second level or third level in here uh, on the first couple of pages just because of the way it is. I'm connected to like, I think, 2,400 of the 2,500 members. So let me go back to the other group, okay? Or we could go to this one, Mentor for Success. Mentors for Success. This is uh, run by Melissa, uh, my friend. She has a um, mentoring group. Again, if you hit members, same spot, this one has 88, it's also new, so if you're looking for um, to mentor or be mentored, join this group. Uh, but if you come down here, so now you'll see, it shows the first levels first. I think that's just LinkedIn's default, but now see, I'm starting to get into the second levels. Now see, I can still hit message. So I don't know May, but I can message her through this because I'm a member of the group, okay? So one of the advantages to joining groups in on LinkedIn is the is the ability to message people that are also in similar groups. So you can agree, you can meet people in the comments, engage with people, talk to them, say, hey, I know I'm capped out, but would you uh, let me know what groups you're in or go view their profile and see what groups they're in. Then you can join that group and then you can send them a message. So if you want to message anyone, really, you know, you want to send Oleg a message or you want to send Craig a message or I don't know whoever whoever your you know guys are and if you want to send me a message join one of these groups that I'm in join project help you grow we'd love to have you there's plenty of room um, if you're not familiar with the premise of project help you grow it started really 
as a, uh, a group for uh, people who are looking to grow their network and to learn how to get better engagement. And then as I uh, talked to people and figured out what they were you know, looking to do, I added some other things. So there's five things here. Help you grow your network, learn how to increase engagement, help you find a job or job search assistance, your business promotion is helping you to promote your business and peer-to-peer -peer free counseling. That's the five tenets or the purposes of the Project Help You Grow group. So if you're looking, that's a good way to do it. If you want to message me, I'm in this group all the time. I'm the moderator. I'm the creator of the group. So anyways, again, go to members, whatever group, and then you can type the name if you know the person's name. Like, let's say you want to find Mike O'Connor. My buddy Mike. Let's say you don't know how to spell his last name. I do. But anyways, now, if you're not connected to him, which I am, of course, he's one of my best friends. Uh, <laughs> but you could hit message and then send him, right? So who else is in here that uh, has a huge following? I don't know. There's lots of people in here. But anyways, you find the person that you want to connect with. If you want to connect with me or anyone else, right? Type in their name and you'll find them that way. So anyways, again, go to groups. Go to members. Type in the name and then hit message and you can send them a message. My name's Ira Bowman. I am the account manager, California Survey and Draft Supply in the Bay Area. If you have any print needs, please let me help you. That's how I make my living. Everything I do at Project Help You Grow and everything else I do is all uh, free helps. I pay for my life <laughs> by selling printer uh, equipment, supplies, service. We even do graphics, uh, printing, and installation services. So if you need a vehicle wrap, you need marketing materials for your trade shows, if you want to put a, a new uh, graphic in your lobby or around your building or whatever the case may be. Basically, if you need anything print related, contact me. If I can't do it, I can point you in the right direction and tell you who can. Uh, I hope this was a help. If you are looking for help growing your network, whatever, Project Help You Grow, if you're looking for a job, go to projecthelpyougrow.com. Have a great day, everybody. Hope you have a really awesome weekend. Talk to you next time.